Yeah, I'll put mine on now. Uh, I'll put it. I'll put yours on if you want, then. Because it's fight week, obviously we can't do nothing too too taxing on the body, like especially with lack of lack of carbs and stuff like that. So this morning I just did a light run, light bit of bike, um, three free pads there, there to get the heart rate up. And um, what we do now is the one person stays in for six minutes, so a bit of a shark tank. Obviously they're not they're not coming at me like they're going at each other there because uh, they <laughs> they take it in consideration I'm a bit skinny. But um, so it's, it's just to work up a sweat, get the heart rate up, like. Morning and night, you know, it's more of a fat burn. Midday, it's nice to just get the heart pumping a bit, get, get, that, get that tiredness feeling, you know, get your arms blown up a bit. So, <clears throat> we're just doing this now. Um, and again, it'll be a light one tonight, so no pads, no rolling, just, just a run and some, some bike. And then we might do this again tomorrow, we'll, we'll see how the weight is. But, yeah, it's all, it's all going well. Obviously, um, this week is just weight management and, and burning calories, so anything like this that breaks it up, you know, there's nothing more tedious than being on the runner for three hours a day. So it's, you know, it's nice to chuck this in the middle, give your leg a break, and it make, makes you think, you know, on the runner, you're just plodding along. But <laughs> this keeps your, your fight IQ firing as well. So, but now the, these pair, these pair going at it a bit more intense than what I did, but, uh, <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> oh, you don't know if it's past it. No way to treat the father. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good switch. Up, 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 up. Knee down, knee down. From me, bang, bang in our body, and eh? before you were safe, good lad. Back. Yeah, so Hernandez, he's um, he's a good striker, comes from from a good gym, D decent all rounder in all fairness. Um, you know, he, he he's good everywhere, so he he brings a lot of threats to the table. But I think fight IQ wise and and skill set wise, I'm just that level in front, and and you know, I, I don't think many in the division can cope with the pressure I bring. So I mean, Saturday night will tell, I suppose. But yeah, he's, he's a good guy. We're looking forward to it. I gotta go because he's he's in the back. I'm like, ah, come here. Get a hook. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, I get asked a lot about the the balance of being a coach and a father, and it's it's, it's really difficult. You know, it's it's not um, psychologically, it's it's not natural. You know, like a father's entire purpose in life is to look after his kids. You know. I'm sending him out there to war, but you know what I what I have made sure is that he's ready. Um, and should he, you know, should he ever lose, it's not for the lack of preparation, and you know it's because he's been beaten a bit, the better man all day. Nervous wise, you know, it kills me. I'll be honest. I'm, I'm fortunate to have Gary and Carl in the corner, two really experienced coaches who take a little bit of the pressure off. Um, but I am excited. I mean, I think I think the pressure is off, and when he's a cage warrior, he's world champ. Everybody's out to get him. Um, Jack said in the other day, it's a bit like going back to his amateur career, starting the shows off. Um, takes away all that pressure. Don't know. We got a, we got good numbers. Is over 500 that we're aware of from Wales on top of whatever's been done online. So it's going to be a good, good reception for him. But it'd be nice to be first fight on. No pressure. You know, he's um, he's a little fish in a big pool now, whereas he was the big fish in, in, in the Cage Warriors event. Uh, uh, hopefully, you know, all the prep's done. 
we'll have the result that he deserves. You know, no one works harder than him, no one trains harder, but um, it's going to be a real stressful, stressful couple of days for me, you know, as his dad more so than a coach, as a coach, you know, we should be enjoying every second. Keep going, lads, keep going. But, uh, you know, our father who comes in and uh, it is all. Don't wrong, when our bell goes, there's nobody m more happy in the building than me, but uh, for me, it's, it's all about him. He's worked for it. You know, I've supported him all the way, but I, whatever he de decided to take on in life, I'd have followed him with it. This is his choice. People think because I'm an, an ex-fighter myself and a coach that I've pushed him. I've never asked him to get in the gym. It's all been off his own back. So um, I'm really proud of how he's applied himself as a fighter. You know, take out the fatherhood. You know, as a coach, me and Carl, we couldn't ask for anybody anybody better with regard to his preparation, his attitude, his, his discipline on the diet. So he's done all the hard work. We'll make weight. Come Friday, we'll enjoy the experience a bit more, I think. Three job isn't it, right? Have to win my spats, man. Boom. Up to the room. Whose phone should I use? Mine? Yeah, use mine. Who's mine, by the way? Cool. Here's his shit. Well, Park's got it, so he's blurry over there. <laughs> no, that's <laughs> not much. Oh, shit. It's a bit dark. I'll do you a few, yeah? 